For thrill seekers and outdoor enthusiasts, a new attraction is now open at Mount Ski Goal. And it's not one that requires skis or snow, but it's an adventure that guides guests through the trees on the new zipline tour. Our Chelsea Brown has more in this week's Northwoods Adventure. Gliding through the treetops is the experience now open at Mount Skeagle with the new Minnesota Zip Lines and Adventure Tour. We thought that, gosh, the Brainerd Lakes area, there's a lot of outdoor recreation here, but there's nothing like it. There's a lot of people that are looking for activities to connect with nature, connect with their families. Let's see if there's an opportunity there. It's been a couple years in the making, but the zip line features a total of nine elements along the tour. It's seven zips. And then there's a 75 foot suspension bridge in the middle and an optional 50 foot free fall experience. Kerfoot is a fourth generation outdoor enthusiast who continues a legacy started by his grandmother. The family has expanded their love for the outdoors, creating now their second zipline adventure located in the Brainerd Lakes area. And so I grew up loving that and doing that. And then we started a zipline company to facilitate that, to enable families to connect with nature, have a great experience. They don't remember who they texted with, they remember what they did and the, the, the adventures they had together. The original plan was designed to look and feel like the Kerfoot Canopy Tour in Henderson, Minnesota. That was until a massive storm hit the Brainerd Lakes area in July. Some of the original trees were lost, but they have used that to enhance the stories they tell of nature. And you'll see, you know, Paul Bunyan has been through there, and that's part of the history, part of the, the nature knowledge that we share with people, but there's still plenty of trees up there too. The course starts off low and slow, with each zip getting faster, longer. You go super fast, about a thousand feet long, and then right towards the end, you slow down like a whole lot. And higher, where guests can see views among the treetops. The 15 mile views, they're amazing, spectacular views. Like you can see Gull Lake, and you've got 15 mile views. You're way beyond uh, Pequot Lakes. But Kerfoot says the best way to end the tour is a free fall at the end. One, two, three. Holy cow, the step off of that, you're at the tower, you're looking down, you say, oh no, and it is like, oh man, it feels great. On this week's Northwoods Adventure, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.